Now, a top-rated vacation rental host is going to spend the next year in jail after admitting in court today that he used a hidden camera to record people inside a secluded Kendall County cabin. A.J. Alley pleaded guilty to six counts of invasive visual recording. Dylan Collier explains how the charges hindered, hindered the possibility of prosecutors getting a longer sentence. After peeking into the personal lives of vacationers without their permission, A.J. Alley found himself on the other side of the camera this morning. What would you like to say to your victims? As the 55-year-old reached Airbnb super host and Verbo premier host status, while renting out this cabin on his sprawling property in comfort, he was secretly recording his guests using this camera made to look like a power adapter. The illegal snooping exposed two summers ago after a couple staying there found the device. How this camera operated is it took uh, what we basically it's a time lapse. So it takes uh, a video or takes a picture every few seconds. So that's how it comes together. Kendall County Sheriff's investigators eventually uncovered more than 2100 thumbnail images, some showing people naked and even having sex. Alley at one point faced 15 felony charges of invasive visual recording, nine of which prosecutors dismissed in exchange for him pleading guilty to the six remaining counts. Our camera was not allowed inside court as Judge Kirsten Cahoon handed Alley six 12-month sentences to run concurrently, meaning he'll spend the next year at a state jail facility. Ali was taken into custody immediately. He's going to have to put together an entirely new life. He's um, the life he had is after he gets out of jail. It no longer exists aside from his family. Because the charge is not considered a sex offense in Texas, Ali faced a maximum of two years behind bars for each charge. Still, I'm relieved because the victims are relieved. So they were waiting for for a resolution in this case, and now they have it. Ali's problems don't end when he gets out of jail one year from now. Many of his victims sued him, Verbo, and Airbnb. Only Airbnb has resolved its case out of court so far. In Kendall County, Dylan Collier, KSAT 12 News.